I would say rent. Um, yeah, rent. rent. Maybe car note. You too. What's good, man? It's your boy She, and I'm back with another video for y'all. Bills a man should pay. You already know how this video gonna go. I ain't even gonna get my two cents yet. But make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe. Shout out to the Rich and Unemployed podcast. Let's get into the video. What bills do you expect a man to pay when you first start dating? Whatever he wants to contribute to, it's fine. But he's not expected. You don't hear that too often. Hold up. You don't hear that too often. She said whatever he wants to contribute to. I don't know, man. You don't hear that. I like that. It to pay for anything. So, but when y'all start dating for real, mm -hmm. you want to pay rent, car notes, alleviation. Especially rates. if he coming over my house and we dating and we he getting some pussy. Yeah, he need to be paying some type of bill, like rent. He need to be paying for where I'm staying at. He need to be paying for what I'm driving. All of them, except for my credit card bills. Okay, let's say I was a year in. Bro, where did these women come from? First of all, and why do women equate sex? With bills, like I'm so confused. Don't sex, don't that take two people? Don't it take two people to mingle? <laughs> I don't get it, bro. I'm lost. It's 2023 and I'm still lost. Together. If we live in together, then... no. Oh, he just your boyfriend. Mm, you know, I still wouldn't expect him to pay any bills mm. of mine unless we were like living together. Mm. Yeah, don't pay for nothing that... I mean, you only pay for stuff that you're using. Or just want to see me pay... For, or don't want to see me pay for. Mm -hmm. But I think that should be like a thing up to you. So you wouldn't look down on a man or look... like He wouldn't be less than a man if he didn't pay no bills. Again, like if he's spending the night at my house, which he's probably doing after a year and stuff like that, then yeah, I think you should be paying bills. Well, you're going to spend the night at my house then, shit. No! <laughs> <laughs> Uh, uh that's not how that works and plus mm -hmm. i got a real comfortable bed so i don't want to stay in I do too. nobody's house let's just say so that's like i understand you've been with this dude for a year you've been with this girl for a year you going to her crib staying at her crib you feel me using up all her stuff all in her refrigerator using her bathroom shower and all that like i understand at that point like yeah you should be paying something as a man you feel me you damn near litter even if you got your own spot, if you there majority of the time, then I would understand if a woman would expect you to, you know what I'm saying, throw a little payment, throw a little, make a little, make a little payment on rent or something like that. I understand completely. But it's nowadays that these women, I meet a nigga for two weeks, just met a nigga two weeks ago, and you expecting him to pay all your bills, pay your rent, pay your, uh, your car pay. Who doing that? That's some rapper shit. Niggas ain't doing that. Yeah, y'all, y'all damn near in a relationship. Like y'all, oh. y'all talk now. We three, four, five months in, six months in. We kind of exclusive. I would say rent. Um, rent. yeah, rent. Maybe car note. Maybe first meeting. I would say, um, maybe like my exercise. Like maybe Pilates. First meeting. Yeah, like I'm like, oh, you know, I'm interested in getting some Pilates or something like that. Can you? I feel like anything first that's upkeep is crazy. Like, if you like your bitch always looking pretty, like hair and nails, whatever. If you got it, like, it, it depends on his finances, too, though. Like, Bro, what does she have on? What the f is this? You got, like, are you gothic? Like, what do you have on? Like, if you got it like that, her car note, mm -hmm. car insurance, you mm -hmm. fucking her. I mean, even if she handles car insurance, health insurance. Because if you fuck her, you want to make sure your pussy healthy. Pay for the health insurance. Go if the bitch ain't got health insurance. Go get the bitch some health insurance. You make sure your put healthy. Why do I have to make sure? Hmm. Interesting. Dental. Fix that whole mouth. Dental. Yes. You know niggas be dating hoes with. Can you do that for me? You gonna you gonna say it? Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Okay. I'll ask. I'm, I believe in asking, but I have a way of asking. You know, I'm not gonna just be coming out the gate like, oh, I need this, I need that. But I will ask. What is he getting in return? He's getting me. He's getting you. Me motivating him, like you know, you. helping him out physically, mentally, emotionally. Hmm. You know, right. cooking, cleaning, oh. manicures, pedicures. You know, I'm I'm reciprocating too. So you know, a little dinner date, something. 
like that movie date. I'm like, I'm like, yeah. cool. Maybe a little pair of shades or something. Nothing too crazy. Uh-huh. <laughs> <laughs> you want me to invest in dental booty ass I'll make you look good for the next nigga so that's why you don't do it for everybody I'm talking about this you said if you dating somebody I mean don't, don't get me wrong yeah. I've, I've done it you know what I'm saying like I done got veneers I done got Invisalign I done got ass jobs but where they how at how much now? ass a lot of ass to be paying for like investing in a nigga let's say um I don't know, whatever his career choice is, like she see the nigga got it or whatever, she might buy whatever equipment he needs to get it to the next level or pay for that little studio session, even though that nigga suck. Um Where they doing that at? Even they do Well, you did that? I got homegirls. Oh, you you haven't done the homegirls I mean I fix credit, but Um How you pay niggas credit? Yeah. Mm. I be trying to build with people. I'm really just nice. I I I can be evil. That's why I get. That's why the gun gets pulled. For sure. Cause there really ain't none of that shit sweet. But I be trying to be sweet. Mm. You know, people come from big, different backgrounds. Like it's already enough um, evil out there. For real, for real. Like I don't be trying to add to it. I be trying to show light. You look evil. You got all that black on. You got. Spikes coming out your tip. You look evil. What good is you putting out? <laughs> but it's good, like the first joint, it's good that there's still women out here like that that don't expect everything from a nigga and don't put, give nothing in return but sex. You feel me? So it's good that there's women still out here like that that are independent, that'll take care of themselves. And if the nigga want to spoil you, then cool. Or if a nigga want to pay your bills, then cool. You know what I'm saying? But don't expect it, like she said. But let me know what y'all think down in the comments. You feel me? Again, like I said, make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe to see I mean we gonna get to the next video.